Would you say it one more time? Tom Stoppard. Or Thank I you. tend to call him Tom Stop It. The theatre does, is not like the double film, and it's the opposite from film. Yeah. Film depends well, what on what is in front of the camera. Theatre depends on what is inside the imagination and the memory of, of the actor and the confluence of actors together while going through the stages of a story. That's what theatre is. Theatre was nothing to do with representing anything or imitating anything, copying anything or being oneself on stage. But it's quite unbelievable it's to think of a you know a well-known uh, English actor who wasn't at the same time showing me himself or herself. He was transparent. I, I miss who it is. Magunad Magi Magu. Imagine opera with no conductor. Yeah, with mean, no orchestra. In, inside, inside in, in, in my case, no orchestra. Just a human being. We don't really know. We're meeting on Friday. But devotion is a totally different word, I think. It, one thinks of sort of pious women dressed in black. Uh, but it shouldn't be. Devotion is the job of a flame of a person who is a flame. I, I, you know, but, but, but the brain and taste become. If I told you, brain and taste become. No. Stop me if I'm yeah. repeating myself. And um, I started yeah. talking to them as I've just been talking. And they said, well, come and do it. Come, come, we'll pay for you to come. Come, come, come <laughs> take, take a workshop for a couple of days. Because I don't want to tell actors how to speak. I want to get actors into a position where they need to speak. You can tell so, the person I mean, they did whom, you, whom you sense from reading the text, uh, and yeah, you become so the person yeah, that's on our, that with on our that presence, like that sense of being, those predominance of sensation. Right. You see, the secret right. of the letter is that it all divides all, all, all sensations exactly. down to nine different so, sorts, exactly. hmm. exactly. and it exactly. finds one of those exactly. as a predominant Feeling, passion, sensation, taste of each person in the play. Yeah. And a good play <laughs> will have five or six they different basic laws. The 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 um, and the interplay between them is extraordinary. So. Now you have a basic yeah. laws, and then on top of that, you know, which may be happiness. But somebody who is not themselves and not remotely like themselves, but you think you understand. You should understand what that sort of person was and what has happened. And, and I'm not going to tell the story very well. It's laughter. I mean, that's one of the nine rounds of his laughter. That is. It's a laughter, isn't it? And you know. Uh, oh, people I mean, are wonderful, isn't it? You know, it is it funny? It's raining or... <laughs> My God, i got no money. <laughs> Sometimes everybody's pleased to see because he's got a joke. <laughs> <laughs> you know? And all we get in the text I did a, is I did a what paper, is permanent. I did a paper about that. What, what is transmittable yeah. in permanent form <laughs> from that I imagination. That. I say, I mean, I write in order to give myself the illusion that I think. One knows that sometimes I'm boring and sometimes I go on too long and sometimes I miss the point and sometimes I don't understand my audience. Yes, don't Talk listen to what I say, just look at me. <laughs> Again, Beckett has a marvellous phrase. It's the silence of the music. It's the silence of the world. And, as Winnie says in Happy Days, the silence of the intimate intercourse. Truth comes through the senses. Everything you know, which is valuable, comes to you not from words you read, but from your senses. From sight and touch and smell and hearing. But what it does, I think that's the way all is to help an actor to allow his or her limbs and veins and nerves, I guess flesh, I guess body fat, to actually be involved in a moment of being. Maria Fornes told me that uh, I, I met her, at, I've only met her once, I met her at a reception uh, in New York and we started talking because I'd long wanted to meet her, I think her place was doing it. And, um, 
And I said, you know, what, 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 what ordinary ghastly cocktail conversation. What are you doing? And I remember she looked at me, she's a wizard old witch. And she looked at me and she said, go through my wardrobe. I said, do what? She said, go through my wardrobe, see what's in there. I said, why are you doing that? She said, because I'm meant to be writing a play. <laughs> and if I go through my wardrobe, I find that my memory is activated. Starts being but it's activated <laughs> not by ideas or persons, but herself. Wearing those no. clothes. No. Not necessarily it's in any not particular my situation. Six beers. But it's it's going through my wardrobe.